Ready for your interview? Yeah. Good luck, babe. Did you get the job? Things have gone terribly wrong. Well. Mike got shocked. Like, my jaw was like... Mm. Oh my gosh, Michael. Was... Here they come. There they Au revoir. Au revoir. <laughs> Good morning, everybody, and welcome to today's vlog and to our house. Today, oh, hi, Alice. Hi, hey, beautiful girl. And there's Edward. Yes, today is a very big day, you guys. I'm very excited about today. Lots of things going on. First thing is, if you can see behind me, this is our hallway. And as my home renovation continues, I painted this hallway last night, maybe, wait, I started I think two days ago. It used to be this ugly, ugly, ugly green. This ugly green right here, and now it's this very pretty gray, light gray. But the one thing that I did not paint, I had to square this out, is our growth chart. Because I realized, shoot, if I paint over that, that's like, I can't do that. It's such a big part of our life. Anyway, so, but I painted the rest of it, and now we're gonna put a new light up. We we're trying to decide between that light and this light, and we have chosen this light. We're gonna put that light up. Dad's gonna do that, or Mike's gonna do that for us later today. So that's number one big thing for today. The second big thing for today is that Ryan's coming home tonight, which I'm so excited about. We have missed him. Goodness sakes, I knew I was gonna miss him, but my gosh, he is such a, um, a personality and brings so much joy to us that he's always around and I miss him, I miss him. So I'm very happy that he's coming home. And um, that's later, later, later tonight though. And Brennan has a big day today because he is going to, he, he applied for his very first job. If you guys saw that video the other day, if you did not, please take a look right there. And he, they called him in for an interview. So he goes in today for his interview at 3.30. So we'll see him before he does that and give him a few interview tips hoping that he gets the job. So that's very exciting for him for his first job. So it's a big, big day today. So Katie and Brennan should come home this afternoon and then go to their, um, Brennan will go to his interview. So stay tuned, see what he looks like before he goes and we'll see how he does on it. Oh, boy. Hi, Edward. Do you want to go outside, sweet boy? You were napping for a long, long time. You ready to go? You go. Ready? Set. Fun, buddy. Have an adventure. All right, you guys, our plan is coming together. Brennan has returned home from school. Woo! Excellent. Are you ready for your interview? Yeah. Which I'm. Tip number one do not oh, answer. Yes. Okay, good. Tip number two don't sit like that in your interview. How are you going to sit in your interview, Brennan? Mm -hmm. Oh, see, you're definitely going to get the job. You're such a good boy. I'm so excited. Are you nervous? No. Okay. <clears throat> Do you know what you're gonna say? Like, do you have any idea what questions she might ask you? Uh, what do you want to look at the YMCA? And what are you gonna say? Well, um, I come here a lot, first of all. Uh, I love being at the Y. And I also, I've been around water my whole life. You know, I like playing water polo and swimming. And uh, I feel like lifeguarding would be the perfect job for me. Fantastic, I like that. All right, all right, all right. Um, what if she says to you, um, what other previous jobs have you had? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's a good answer. <laughs> <I'm> like, <laughs> How about this is my first job, but I'm very, I want you to know I'm very responsible and reliable. So I think that's what people care about a lot. They want you to show up and they want you to, like they don't want you to leave them high and dry. And they want you to be able to execute the job flawlessly. This would be my first job, but I'm very responsible. That's fantastic, Brennan. Okay. All right. How about, um, what if she says to you, Michael, what's another interview question? What are you looking for in a, in a good lifeguard? And then when they tell you, you say, I, I, I think I can deliver that. So oh, the, the man ability. just came up from, <laughs> you're just ahead. <laughs> well, good question. <laughs> okay. Thanks for, thanks for asking. You're like a whack-a-mole, bam! <laughs> it looks especially nice next to my nice new wall. So a couple things, uh, tips, just tips, press tips, or do you not want them? Yes. So uh, I think uh, being uh, very polite and respectful is good. So thanks for your time, I appreciate you seeing me. That's awesome, that's a great way to start. Mm -hmm. Um, a nice firm handshake. Because sometimes, can I, can I jump in? Because you're going to be shaking the, the hand of a woman. <laughs> yeah, Mike, you go down. And listen, this is the deal. Sometimes 
when ladies shake their hand, they go like this, which is a very old fashioned thing to do. So even if she does do that, like I would try to shake it. Yeah. What do you think about that, Mike? What if she gives you the, what if she gives you the soft hand? <laughs> Pop up there. Oh my gosh. I don't think she will. I don't think many people do that anymore. Right? No, no. So a nice firm handshake, okay. He's got that naturally though, right? He taught, me, he taught me a nice firm handshake. Well, I know that Brendan has it. I just wanted to be, he probably doesn't yes, shake a lot of women's hands. There's nothing worse than a, a lip handshake. A lip nothing handshake. Nothing worse, nothing yes. worse. Always nice and firm. Not too firm, but always nice you and firm. You don't want to hurt them, yes. but yeah, nice and firm. Nice firm. Show confidence. Here you go, Mike, ready? Yes. Hey, nice to, nice to meet you. Thanks for your time. Thank you. All right, very good. When, so when she says you have any questions for me, you're gonna say. When do I start? No, you say, what am I, what are you looking for in a lifeguard? That might be a little cocky. Uh-huh. You could say, but what if she's already told him what she's looking for in a lifeguard? Then what could he say? Well, you Always have a question in your back what pocket. What are you looking for in a lifeguard? What are some of your best lifeguards? What, what are they doing that I, I might be able to do? Or what are good lifeguard qualities? That's what I'm mm -hmm. Perfect. Is there anything that I should be aware of that is, that I should look out for? Anything that is sort of a challenge that I should I be prepared you know for? Huh? I said, you know, Simon and Gabe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your yeah. two friends who are lifeguards. Um, awesome. Yes. Yes. All right. And my, how about your schedule, Brendan? What kind of um, scheduling opportunities do we have um, to hire to, to, for you to work? I work, or uh, I play water polo 6 to 8.30 Monday through Thursday. Um, I have five days open, Saturdays open. But if you're ever in a, in a bind, or you could always call me, and if I'm available, I'd be, jump, I'd be able to jump in. Like so, if you're ever short staffed, well, that's not true. You're hired. And what, about, what if I'm at practice and she calls me? And she mm -hmm. No, as you say, yeah, call me to check in. If I'm available, I'll come in. You know yeah. what I mean? So it's like saying, like, you know, because maybe one Monday you don't have practice because you had a tournament or whatever, and yeah. she's like, hey, I need somebody. All right, so this is the deal. I'm gonna let Brendan eat and contemplate. Job, We're still proud of you. <laughs> Brendan wants to wear a shirt that has a bar on it. <laughs> it's a fishing t shirt. <laughs> but she doesn't know it's a fishing t shirt. It's from Iceland. I think, um, you know, it's worth uh, putting on a collared shirt then. I know it's a, a lifeguard job, that's cool, but I'd put a collared shirt on. I would too. How about just a t shirt? <laughs> Are you trying to negotiate down? I don't think that's a good idea. I think you should wear a collar shirt. Just my opinion. Huh? Just my opinion. I've been through a lot of job interviews. This is your first one. I would trust me. No. <laughs> All right, well, good luck to you. Good luck. Soon you'll be moving out of the house and uh, you're gonna need a place to live and to make money. So I hope you, hope you get a job. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Brennan's friend Simon is also already a lifeguard at the Y. You're so nice for no reason. And I said, well, why don't you ask Simon what he wore? And Brennan, what do you wear to his job interview? Collared shirt and khakis. Brennan would admit it. Collared shirt and khakis, Mike. <laughs> mommy wins, mommy wins, mommy wins. Great tip. <laughs> right, Mike? Always good luck. Okay. <laughs> All right, that's much better, Brennan. You look very handsome, professional. Thank you. You're welcome. Ready to go. I have to grab my phone now. Oh, that's a good idea. There he is. All right, babe. Looking great. Thank good you. luck. Love you. I, I know you'll do one. one. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I always do. Let's try number two. Take number three. <laughs> very good, Brennan. She says, when can you start? I think you could let her know that your availability during school is limited. You'll be have more potentially in the summer, but you could start on Saturdays or Sundays. Saturday. Sounds good. This coming Saturday? But wait, you have to get a um mwah. you have to um get certified first, don't you? Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, so you got some time. Good luck, babe. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye. Alright, Brennan, he's back already. How'd it go? Success. Did you get the job? I said if I uh, pass the certification, I'll hire me. Woo! That's fantastic. So are they gonna pay for your certification? Uh, so you have to just call her and set it up? Yeah. That is awesome. Did you like her? Yes, she's very chill. Um, and they said like, all the lifeguards are friends and it's like a chill like environment there, so. Oh, 
Okay, good. And it, what questions did she ask you? Like, were you prepared? Did she we? Did that never very well? Why do you want to be a lifeguard? Okay, good. You had um, that one down. Why do you want to work for the Y? That's a good question. What'd you say? That's a because the Y is a good place to work. I said, um, she said, besides convenience, because I love coming to the Y, and um, I believe in the core values. She said, I want to interview of the year. No way! Seriously, <laughs> she really did. Brandon, you're awesome. I'm not surprised. Congratulations. Yeah. That'll be a good job. Are you excited? Yeah. Yeah. It'll be fun to work there, I think. I mean, it'll be some long days, but it'll be good. All your friends will be there, and it's yeah. awesome. You just go there and work out? Yeah, I'm literally just going to work out right after, so. Fantastic. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Congratulations, Brandon. Thank you. Yay. All right. We're not doing so well here at the Totally House. Ow, ow, ow. Things have gone terribly wrong. <laughs> things have gone Terribly so wrong. if you need mouth to mouth resuscitation, just call. Okay, thank you. Raise your hand. I'm having chest pains. I'm not sure what's going on. My arm doesn't hurt, so I'm pretty sure it's not serious, but okay. it's not good. I don't like it. Katie Elizabeth, what's going on with you, lovey girl? <laughs> I get migraines. <laughs> she had a migraine today. Oh, she just woke up from her little nappy poo. Oh, well, my sorry. arm does go numb. Yeah, did it? Do you have any numbness with this one? Not anymore since back, but it, have, it like started like when I went to bed and then I was like, okay, I'm falling asleep. It's heavy. Oh my goodness. Mm. And then dad. <laughs> Mike got shocked. He put together my new, um, my new light, which by the way, let me show you. He's shocked. <laughs> Yay! This is the new light, you guys, in the new hallway. We're gonna, we're, that's not gonna be there. But look how beautiful that looks. But it was while I was gone. And, it, and you got shocked. Did you not turn the electricity off? All right, I'll be. <laughs> talking backwards. <laughs> backwards talking. <laughs> Reason you're for like, some. You're Yoda. <laughs> Something's gone wrong terribly. <laughs> okay. Poor uh -huh. dad. The clenching of the teeth really was delightful. Dad texted me. Mike texted me. I was at a meeting. Mike texted me and said, I just got shocked so hard that my, teach, <laughs> my teeth clenched. He's like this. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, how's Katie? So my first thing was, how's Katie? And he said, she's sleeping. Because I knew you weren't feeling well. She's sleeping. And then he said, I just, just got shocked so hard that my teeth clenched. I'm thinking, dad's going to die. <laughs> Katie's sleeping. Nobody even knows what's going on. Ryan's on a bus on the way home from Quebec. Brennan's at Water Polo. Just another day here at Donnelly's. Just another day. That's what goes on. Mm -hmm. But you're feeling better? <laughs> Dad, next time you plan on getting shocked. Feeling better. Feeling better, actually, I am. <laughs> I could feel it, like, go through my body, and, like, my jaw was, like... Oh, my gosh, Michael. It was really something. So that means you didn't turn the electricity off. Is that correct? I said to myself, I have to do this for real. <laughs> Have to do this for Jill. She was so Thank sad. you. And you know what, honey? It was worth it because it looks fantastic. Thank you. <laughs> worth getting shocked. All right, Kate. Temporary lockjaw. Yeah. <laughs> really pretty hallway. It's, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Some things are. Oh, hi, buddy. Beauty is. Um, what do they say? Okay. Yes. Now, people are going to say you should turn the power off, but I couldn't turn the power off because I had to be able to see. <laughs> but there's a. Oh. Exactly. Well, you can't, so but you can't. They're going to say, that's right. they're going to say, turn on the yeah. blinker off. Well, you never know which one that is. Well, you can use the flashlight. I know, that was, I know. Okay, I shouldn't second guess what you did. Thank you. It's all and, good. And so don't comment below on that. Yeah, exactly. Don't say, don't make any comments. Right. About how dad did it wrong. Just empathy is good. Exactly. <laughs> Good, just empathy. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> but if you're ever gonna change a light, you guys, electricity off, you should turn. Uh <laughs> <laughs> Was it funny? Like, <laughs> yes, we're cracking ourselves yes. up. Hi, little one. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's not, that's, that's, I was gonna say my legs are sore. Okay, I'm good. Not that was just. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you your shirt, you're out of you. Welcome to the no. Donnelly's. No. Oh gosh. No. All right, guys, it's 9 12 at night. Ryan arrives home at 11 or 11 30. I'm very excited. I might be awake. I'm just for the table. Yeah, what are you, you will be awake, right? I'm, I'm
Oh, good. That would be nice. Yes, Katie. So, Wait, what do you think? Not backsplash. Yes. Why? I thought. But we will put, it, put like light gray grout in between. Put what do you guys think? Should we do that? Comment down below. If you think our backsplash should, please comment down below, I should say. I don't mean to order, order you to do you something. Put it on the top or you take those out? Um, I looked up a YouTube video that said I can tile over existing tile in the backsplash. Wow. So I think I'm gonna tile over tile. Wow. Don't work out to rush. <laughs> because. <Yeah. laughs> and I don't even do that, many, that much like that. Just let them be. I don't even do that much like that, but I regret it. Do you really? Oh gosh, Brendan. Yeah. Hey, you should take a bath in Epsom salt. It's I right under there. Okay, do your homework in there. In the bath salt? Yeah. With paper? Yeah. All right, Brendan, what made you happy today? You need to calm down. Mm -hmm. I'm happy today, I'm just getting a good workout in and a good water pool practice. How about getting a job? You said I got the job. You said you got the job. If I passed the. Well, you told us that you got certification. Oh, okay. All right. So it's not really official. Oh, for Pete's Basically. sake. Was it fun interviewing, by the way? Uh, no. It wasn't. Was it? Were you nervous? No. But it wasn't fun. Like I didn't. Like, you didn't enjoy I, the conversation. No. You weren't like a rock in this. Even though she said you won the best interview of the year. Yeah. Oh, I'm so proud of you. I'm so excited, Ryan. I'm following Ryan on my app. I have Life360. <laughs> and I'm following him. And the bus has just turned on the road that the school is on. So he will be here in literally like four minutes. No, two minutes. Two minutes. So I'm going to go out and get him. Oh, I'm so excited. <laughs> I've been following him his whole trip, I have to say. Not stalker, just excited. <laughs> All right, you guys. Here they come. Here comes their bus. It is raining. But boy, oh boy, oh boy. I'm so excited to see Ryan and the whole crew. Okay, very good. Well, you'll do, you'll, do yes, you'll, um, what's the word? Yeah. Not defer, you'll yeah. concede. You'll concede. concede. Yeah. What's this? That, that was a good one. Hey? That's picture. our picture. <laughs> you guys oh, are gonna get I turned it over so it wouldn't no, get wet. You, you guys are gonna get mad. Really bad shot. You, guys are you mad. didn't smile, did you? Whoa! <laughs> Oh, There's me. Right. Oh, that, was it bright and sunny? Okay. It was so sunny and it was bouncing off the snow. Wow. And yes. I didn't bring my sunglasses. Just, that, that's the only time I needed them. Right. But I brought my sunglasses like every other time. And I, <laughs> that's it was so, so funny. And, and, and it was the one. And, 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 and I saw his finger go down to press the picture. So I was like shielding my eyes just for a second. And then he took another one. And I was like, no. no and then that's the one he used. Yeah, that's cut. Yeah, I think that's an Epcot. Oh that's, that's, Italy, that's Italy, though. Oh, Canada, maybe they did. Yes, that's, uh, like that's a hotel. Really. That's a, where you stay? No. That's a hotel? Oh. Oh, no. That goes from $300 to $3,000 a night. Oh, my oh, gosh. Right. Uh, Brian, welcome home. Thank you very I'm much. Home. It's great to be here. Good to see you. Good to see you. Good to see you. I'll um, see you in the morning. I want to hear all about your trip. What made right. you happy anyway? Ryan, safe return. Yeah. 
I agree. What made you happy today, Rye Guy? My safe for tonight. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> yeah, That's and what made just, me happy just too. laughing with the boys all the time. It's just such a fun group to be with. Oh. Um, and uh, I gotta wrap up my vlog. You can go see that oh. on my channel. Hopefully, it'll be out by now. I'll edit it and uh, and get that up. up. You've lied to me. I'm so sorry because um, Mr. Dean, Mr. Dean took some pictures and. Um, some videos, but I couldn't, I can't, like, I couldn't really film it, because it was a school trip I wanted to yeah. you guys know, and, like, I was having so much fun, yeah. and I was just filming in between things, I really wanted to, by the end of the trip, I kind of got it, and I was, like, wanted to be in the moment, because I don't want to yeah. say, I'm doing this, and then say, right. after, oh, it was so fun, because that's not fun to watch. Exactly, right. But, and, I, I try to give you an understanding, it was a school trip, and I was trying to have fun with my friends, but I still wanted to vlog, so, hopefully you guys enjoy it, because I want to work hard on it, and I have some ideas of how to edit it in my head so you can i just had pictures too you can do a lot of like yeah exactly. pictures in i was checking my instagram i post a lot of pictures i did there. see that did you see my comment oh my gosh Whoa. so on the on, like for 30 minutes straight on the bus ride home i tagged all my friends they were like oh i gotta follow her oh i gotta follow her and then uh we saw you comment and then <laughs> everyone and then i was like yo everybody replied to my mom's comment oh right did now. they yeah, <laughs> oh, i didn't it, see it yet you didn't see it Okay, I'll you go gotta go on it. I'm gonna head to the bathroom really quick because okay. I didn't want to go on the bus. Yeah. Because Lucas went and I didn't want to go after Lucas. <laughs> All right, you guys, what made me happy today was definitely Ryan's safe return home and my new light. So comment down below what made you guys happy today. Happy to have my boy home, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.